Well, there's a, a large degree of artistic license going on. I, I started watching footage of, of Father Amorth and started, you know, reading his articles that have been translated into English and then, you know, his books. I just read the first two, there's 12 or something of these books, you know. And my interpretation of uh, Father Amorth, you know, came down to two things that I thought I could perceive from what I was reading. You know, what gets him through his job, what makes him successful in his job, and his job, if we just put it in context, is constantly dealing with afflicted people and the families of afflicted people. So he spends, you know, a lot of time in very dark situations, spiritually, emotionally, right? But for me, the distillation of Father Morth was a purity of faith and a sense of humor. So I had, you know, went back to the filmmakers and I said, we, we've got to expand this a little bit. We've got to put some biographical details in so people really understand a little bit more about who this guy is and, you know, his attitude to things. You know, I mean, he's got some pretty famous quotes out there and, and some of them, you know, went against uh, where the Catholic Church wanted him to be, you know? You see people come along and they do one thing of a certain type and then you see them do 50 versions of that same thing. You know, after I did Gladiator, you know, I was offered Alexander, I was offered Troy, I was offered all these things, but I, I, to me it felt like covering ground I'd already been over, you know? So, you know, when you've been around for as long as I've had and you've done as many different things, you know, what turns you on is possibly a little more extreme or, you know, uh, just areas that I haven't been into. That's where my fascination with this comes from. The, the thing that really caught my attention, though, was I had no idea there was a job called the Chief Exorcist for the Vatican. I didn't, didn't know that was an actual thing, you know? And uh, that really interests me. And as I was saying, when I looked into the man himself, um, I knew I could have some fun with it while battling Satan, but still, you know, um, that purity of his faith and that sense of humor means that I could approach it with a certain lightness of touch. Yeah.